There have been two main challenges to getting genetic testing routinely available for the cancer patients that need it. One was getting access to that testing and the second was working out who should have the testing. So traditionally, getting access to testing involved quite a complicated referral to different pathways. So one of the things that we've been doing is getting that access available in the cancer clinic. And that's gone very well. The second aspect was working out who should have the testing and having simple criteria for that. We used to have really very complicated criteria, but now we've got six simple criteria, which is all women with ovarian cancer and a proportion, about a third of women with breast cancer. So that makes it much easier for patients and doctors to work out who should have the testing. We've been able to roll this um, pathway out at the Marsden Hospital and that's gone very well. Uh, we've also looked at how effective it would be for the NHS and it would be cost effective for the NHS to do this because it would um, save uh, lives and cancers occurring in the future. So now what we're doing is really working to see how we could uh, make it work for the rest of the country and indeed the rest of the world.